Welcome back to Star Ocean, the second story. So we're in the Cave of Crimson Crystals, and we are looking for a wild Synod. We have got a new guest character with us. I believe is, uh, what's his name, Noel? Uh, where is he? Yeah, there we go. Uh, I think his name's Noel. Yeah, Noel. He's just a guest at the moment, but maybe he'll become a recruitable character later on. We don't know. Anyhow, let's uh, have a little peruse through this uh, through this dungeon and uh, see what things are like. So I'm going to start off going left. Always on the left side. Yeah, that's the correct side. Amulets of flexibility. Ooh, let's check that out. Nullifies petrification. Okay. So do we have to be mindful of being potentially petrified in here? We don't know. I've had a little tussle with some of the enemies. Uh, wait, how do we go... Down... Uh, let's go up. Yeah, just to see what they're like. Let's take a look. Yeah, we're, we're at a decent level. But we still can't afford to... Like, be complacent. Still gotta play things a little bit carefully. There we go. Finally over. Finally over. All right, good stuff. Good stuff. Uh, oh god. Here we go, the triple. God damn, I gotta get these numbers down. I'd say that was 8 out of 10. Damn. Huh. Who's the man now? Yikes. That is work. Alright, I tell you what. I'm, uh... Yeah, I'm going back with the Eterna. Like... We're doing the fights. They're not difficult. Well, I mean, they are. They're not... Too... Not difficult, but like we do have to 
think of it about them. And they, they do take time, really. So I think, uh, given that, there's nothing wrong. Oh. Oh, hello. Ow! That's her. I hope nobody saw that. I'm never gonna find a man if they see me tripping around all the time. <laughs> that that is true. That is true. Guys are particularly picky. Never lets up, does she? I'm amazed she's out here by herself. Pro tip for you all you ladies out there. Don't ever let a guy see you trip over. That's just a deal breaker. God, come on. Triple. Okay, good stuff. Yeah, I, I, I gotta say, it's uh, having the friggin' Eterna just to help make these fights a little bit more manageable. This is just necessary. But um, I'm saying that, though, that shouldn't take away or that shouldn't detract from, like, the game, per se. Because, like, I mean, the, the game is awesome. Well, not, not like, the, the game, yeah, but I mean, like, it shouldn't detract from the, uh, the combat. Whoa, what's this? Looks like a business card. Chisato Madison, reporter, The Need Times. Oh, so she's with the press. So we have Chisato's card, we'll need that. Slight spoiler here, Chisato might become a uh, recruitable character, but yeah, we, uh, we kinda, we're going to need to decide on who our final character is going to be. It might be Chisato, it might not be. You never know. Theory of Symbology. Wait, what is that? A thick book containing every fundamental theology, a theory of symbology. Okay. What, is that like a... a thing for... Oh, yes it is, something for Leon. But... Oh man, it's not nearly as good as the one we've got at the moment, it's the academic book. Look at that, it drops our intelligence, drops our luck. Ups our attack, but Leon is not an attacker. So uh, I think yeah, we'll just we'll stay with what we've got at the moment. That's another interesting thing about this game. Like, I do like the um, I I do like the um, the range of different items you can get. So it's never the case that um, you'll, you'll, you're only ever able to get like one particular. Thing to uh, to level up your guys. Yeah, so there's like always a reasonable number of different upgradable items or, or, or things. For you. What the hell? I guess that's where we're going down there. Yeah, a, a decent number of uh, upgradable items and things for you to get. Uh, let's go along. But then I suppose that also means um. Like, the game also encourages item creation and whatnot. Like, exploring, of course. Good stuff. Oh, we can't carry any more spectacles. I guess we are going to have to discard, yeah. I don't think I've encountered that there. We're at max spectacle capacity. That's mad. Uh, we, nope, we're not going that way. We're going here. Uh, so... Looks like we can go down that way. When we're not getting back attacks, of course. There we go. That was easier than I thought. Oh, these guys want to fight, do they? 
Oh boy. That was what. Oh, come on, dude. My god. Hang on, I need to check something here. Because it seems like we have a. Uh, we're doing a lot of fighting. So we don't have train on. Are we set to look for enemies? There we go. Do nothing. I don't, want, I don't want us actively looking for enemies. So we need to go to the left. Yeah, that's the next place to go. So yeah, let's just check to the right first. Uh, just check everyone. We are good. Yep. I will say one thing though. Uh, let's go up here. Yeah, so um, we're getting some decent experience, and uh, all this experience is netting us a buttload of um, Eagle's Shawl. Uh, yeah, go on, Leon. A buttload of uh, um, ability points and stuff. So with the ability points, of course, we can increase our stats and stuff. And uh, yeah, all around be in a good way. Uh, we've got, got to go back. Got to go back. Got to go this way. Got to go past you. And heal up. Okay. Let us do this. Like so. I think everyone else is in a good position. We should have a boss fight coming up now. That's why I'm just getting ready for this. Uh, do we want to improve anything? No. No, I think we're good. Let's see what... Okay, a couple of ladies and a Synod. Ah, uh, the Synod! Oh no, we've got to help it! Alright, we should be able to take on these ladies. There we go, Leon's Shadow Flare time. And he's loved using the spell. This, and he's got another water one that he uses. Every now and then as well. Yeah, but w one thing I gotta say that I do, I, I, I mean, I. I might complain about like the number of fights we have, but the combat. Look at that there. Look at Leon using his like one of his most powerful spells when there's only like half an enemy left. Yeah, this this type of combat is like it's just so interesting. You know, just so different and refreshing and, and engaging. And just think, when this game came out. The type of combat that we would have had with the game would have been turn-based. Any problems? Just count on me. Excellent. Those monsters injured the Synard in that battle. Do we really still have to fight it just to establish some kind of stupid pecking order? It's a good Don't. question, Claude. It's hurt. Stop it! I beg you. What's that? Baby Synards! Ooh. Are you sure about this, Claude? I can't do this. I can't take a child from its mother, and I certainly can't fight with an injured Synard. Claude. You can call me a wimp if you want, but I can't do it. I'm sorry. I'm with you on this one, Claude. I am with you.
it's all right. You've made the right choice. I guess we're done here. We'll have to go back to Nal and see if there's something else we can do. Wait a minute! Um, what is it, Noel? It's acting strange again. Like it's trying to tell us something. Reyna! You want to help us? You know what it's saying, Reyna? It's just a matter of getting your thoughts across. After that, the rest is easy. Let's go. Okay, isn't she a bit injured? Thank you for all your help, Noel. This sign art is just what we need in the battle against the Ten Wise Men. Wait! Can you take me with you? Oh. Noel? The Ten Wise Men would never exist if it weren't for the mistakes my needy and forefathers made. I wouldn't feel right leaving you to shoulder the burden alone. Noel! Besides, the Wise Men have sent my animals into a violent frenzy. That's enough motivation for me to want to fight them. That's a decent bit of motivation. So we've got to make a decision here. We can either take Noel, or we can not take him and take Chisato. And we have slowly been collecting the clues and the private actions that lead up to, uh, to getting Chisato. So, hmm. Who do we take? I'm going to go with Chisato. I think, I think, from a story perspective, it kind of makes sense for Noel to stay here and protect the animals. I mean, that's his whole thing. I mean, he, well, he doesn't need to come and get engaged in some intergalactic fights, you know, with us. We, we, we'll, I'm sure we'll find another Nidian. So I think it's better for him to stay and protect these animals. Isn't that all the more reason why someone needs to stay and watch over the protection zone, though? We need you to protect the animals, Noel. Claude. There's got to be some way to calm the animals down again. I think you're the only one who'd be able to figure it out. We both have different battles to fight. Yeah, you're right. I am still the director, I suppose. Yeah, you see? We will defeat the Ten Wise Men. Trust me. Leave it with us, Noel. I hope you do. We need them gone from our lives to have our peace and tranquility back. Noel, You should pay another visit to the Centropolis next. You need to tell Mayor Nall that you've procured a sign art. I hope I'll see you all again. Sure. Aw, oh, well done, Noel. Well done. Blue wings racing through the sky. Okay. Uh... Oh, did we get some steel armor? Yeah, okay, we'll... We'll take it. All right. Man, look at this. How cool is this? How very, very cool is this? Okay. So, uh, let, and we're not going in the cave. As we said, we need Chisato next. We're gonna recruit her instead of Noel. Let's go recruit her instead of Noel. Oh, what's down there? What a what a what could be down there, I wonder. Uh, that's where we were. Let's head over to Centropolis. Which is here. Okay. Um, actually, let's see. Yeah, we do have a private action. No, we don't. No, we do not. Okay, let's um, head back to see the mayor. And I believe Chisato should be around here somewhere. Oh, wait, where would she be? Yeah, she should be in here, right? I think. Yep, 
Yeah, let's just keep going upstairs. Up and up and up we go. Actually, who's this guy in the corner here? I meant to check him out earlier. Let's see. Hey there, you want me to take a look at something you've written? Ooh, okay. Need publishing co. Come back later when you've written something worthwhile. Uh, okay, so that's a publisher. That's good to know. Well, it makes me want to write something now. Hmm. Yeah, let's go in here. Ah, welcome back. I hear you found your Synod. We certainly have, sir. Everything worked out just fine. Well, splendid. This is no time to be resting on our laurels, however. I'll need you to find and acquire the source of need energy as quickly as possible. The source of needs energy? Precisely. It's time for you all to understand the source of needs energy. In other words, the nature of symbology. The nature of symbology is one step above your traditional symbology. It is the power that we wield as Needians that you must combine with the latent powers inside your own bodies. That, I believe, is the only method we have to defeat the Ten Wise Men. Okay. As much as I'm ashamed to admit it, even if we as Needians had every drop of our own power at our fingertips, I fear it would still not be enough to create a force that could overcome our enemy. So what should we do exactly? There are four fields dotted across the land, located in different directions away from the Centropolis. You must ride your Synod to each one of these fields. Fields? Yes. Each field you encounter will have its own trial to overcome. If you cannot beat the trials, then you will be barred from proceeding any further. I'm not quite sure I follow you, Mayor. Unfortunately, I can't tell you any more than that. The trials differ for every person who challenges them. Oh. So I guess we'll just have to go see for ourselves. The Field of Wisdom is north of the Centropolis, and the Field of Might is to the northwest. Southeast lies the Field of Courage, and the Field of Love is in the skies to the northeast. Allow me to give you this. This is called a Rune Code. What's that? In order to prevent abuse, the four fields are usually kept locked in an offline state. This rune code is necessary to release the lock. Okay. You should probably try to visit the Field of Wisdom first. That one is located on a pentagonal island north of the Centropolis. Also, I understand that the defenses guarding the Field of Love are extremely dangerous. It may be best to save that field for later until you're sure your party is fully ready for what is awaiting you there. Thanks, Mayor. Ah, yes. One more thing. I have assembled the Nidian Defense Forces. They are stationed in the northeastern town of Lakwa. If you ever need their services, feel free to consult with them at any time. Certainly. I have one final gift for you. Hopefully, it will help you in your journey. Okay, I love getting stuff. Phase unit. Phase gun now usable. The phase gun is once again usable. Oh, this is the gun we had at the beginning of the game. BP can also be spent to improve it. Alright, cool stuff. Very, very cool stuff. Now, just gonna head down here quickly. Because. Wait, uh, no, it's not here. I'm gonna go down one more. Yep, this is the one. Okay, so. 
See, we've got a little exclamation mark in the, uh, over in the corner. And look who it is! You're Chisato Madison, aren't you? Well, yes. How did you know my name? We found your business card in the Cave of Crimson Crystals. Oh, I dropped it, huh? Yep. So tell us, why are you following us around all the time? Well, why do you think? You're the great hero sallying forth to slay the Ten Wise Men. I'm just covering your beat. Haven't you noticed the publicity you've been getting? Every man, woman, and child on need is following your story right now. What, well, they are? Uh, that still doesn't mean you have to go sneaking around monster territory by yourself like that. Are you kidding me? I'm a crusader for the truth. No monster could possibly withstand my burning passion for the story. Yeah. Are you sure about that? Of course not. I'm just joking. Oh. I may not look it, but I've got a black belt in the Jingu martial arts. My hands are lethal weapons. Really? Neat! I couldn't stay with you guys unless I could defend myself a little, you know? What? So, so wait, you're gonna keep following us? Well, duh! I've gotta find out how your story ends. But... but it's dangerous! It is quite dangerous. Oh, it's alright. I'm more than capable of taking care of myself. Uh, okay then, go on. Would you like to join us? In that case, why don't you just join us? Huh? You're going to be tailing us anyway, aren't you, Chisato? We might as well make it a little easier for you. Well, sure, but... Are you sure it's okay? Sure we're sure. We'd feel a lot more at ease that way, too. <laughs> In that case, I'd be happy to accept your offer. Aw, oh, well done. Well, you heard him, boss. Is it okay if I go on assignment for a while? Brilliant! As long as you keep your deadlines, you can go anywhere you want for all I care. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. Okay, and with that, we have our eighth party member, a hot-blooded journalist. We have Chisato. Okay, now, let's see if we can do some private actions. Uh... Where are they? There's one here. Hey, Leon. You mind if I interview you? I've got a great idea for a special feature. The secrets of Dr. Leon D.S. Guest. Behind the genius. Sure, whatever. <laughs> Alright, first question. As a scientist, what is your main goal right now? Nothing in particular. Hmm, alright. Question two. What made you decide to become a scientist? My mom and dad were. Straight to the it point, wasn't isn't originally he? your idea? Not really. My parents were scientists, so it was a pretty easy decision. <sighs> you lead a pretty boring life, don't you? I think it's just that you're asking me boring questions, lady. Why don't you ask me about something more interesting? Like some technical stuff instead. A what? Uh, calm them both down. Or ask for an interview. Maybe ask for an interview. Now, now, calm down, you two. How about I stand in for you, Leon? Oh, how nice. Chisato, guess Claude will be answering for me then. I don't want to interview Claude. I'm here because I wanted your answers, Leon. Oh. Aw, man. Look, I'm busy right now, okay? See ya. Aw. Well, we tried. <sighs> you didn't have to butt in there, Claude. Oh, sorry. I, we thought we were helping. Oh dear, okay, that hasn't endeared us with uh, old Chisato. Let's, um... Yeah, let's carry on. Uh... What is down here? No, let's head outside. Uh, no more private actions. Curious, there have to be some, surely. Well, oh, what's... N uh, is the, in is the interview over? Yeah, Claude's right, let's go check the guild. 
Might have some stuff going on there. Hey, Rena. Uh, what builds do we have today? Uh, yeah, let's get all of these things. And we can report replication. Alright. I think I should be doing a few more of these here, to be honest. Okay, Rena. I still can't believe I was born on this planet. Yeah, yeah, you are, Rena. This place is seriously lacking greenery. Uh, and while, yeah, while we're here, let's take a look at uh, stuff that can be stolen. Ring of Sadness, no. No. Uh, treasure card. Uh, this planet seems to be high in symbology. Yeah, we know that there. Do we know you? No, we've uh, already tried to steal from her. Hmm. Okay, well, I think that might be it. In terms of private actions, at least. Yeah, let's, uh, let's save up quickly and head out of town. Uh, okay. Uh, let's head over to North City. So yeah, the exclamation marks there show us the locations of the four uh, trial areas that we have to undertake. And we will be undertaking them pretty soon. But before that, we've got other stuff to do. Oh, curious. No, no private actions. I really thought we would have seen some. Oh, come on. Bowman. Yeah, okay, so... Yeah, no, no private actions, it seems interesting. Alright, well... Uh, let's just check Chizato's equipment. Because we might have to do some equipment min-maxing. Find what we need. Oh, look, we, we could start affording some of this stuff here. We could start getting some of this good stuff. Yeah, okay, so we'll, we'll be coming back here. Right, but one more thing to do before we call it a day. Uh, is it cyanide we need? It might be cyanide. Hang on, so we're there. Noel's home is up there. Uh, so yeah, we need to jump on you. And head over to this continent. Now. What could this be, I wonder? Let's see. Arm lock. Alright, let's uh, go into private action mode. Maybe there's some stuff to see in arm lock. Nothing. Can you believe it? Uh, well... Oh, what's this here? The city of Weaponsmiths. The one place on need where the crafting of weapons is allowed. The Nidians may be pacifists, but perhaps they could not completely give up their arms out of fear of calamities. Alright, that's pretty cool. Uh, where... Oh, yeah, inside here, isn't it? Oh, hey, Rena. There's so many weapons here. All my weapons are first rate. Let's see what you got. Force sword? Wait, so that's not as good as, uh... Uh, how... Let's take a look at stats. It's not as good as the sword blade. Or a Blade of Ruin. That there would be for Diaz if we had him. Alright, maybe we should... Oh. No, we can actually see how, how it works on all of the uh, other characters. And the Ray Gun. Oh, the Ray Gun's for Chizato. Well, oh, we do actually have some guns, don't we? So, let's check those out on Chizato. Alpha Clip for her. Okay, slight damage increase. 
Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Come back sooner. Alright, this is arm lock. This is uh, all... Good. Would there be anything new in the guild? I don't think so. Yeah, nothing new in the guild. Alright, I think that's about it. In terms of interesting stuff that we can do here. Go back to normal mode. I mean, this is a place that we have to come to. You know, just to look around and stuff. And we will come back. But this isn't the place we want to go to. We want to go... further along. Uh, so we need to... Not tactics. Where's that bunny? Come on, bunny! Oh, come on, bunny! Come on, bunny! There we go! Alright, who doesn't love a bunny rabbit? Okay, I think this is where we want to be going now. Look at all those balloons. Doesn't this place look like a world of fun? Yep, let's go into Fun City. I'm sorry, but you'll need to purchase tickets before I can let you through. Uh, okay. Let's go purchase some tickets. Welcome to Fun City, home to the Need Playtown. Would you like to purchase tickets? Yes. Tickets are 75, 75 volt each. Uh, so, eight, yeah, 600 volt for the eight of us. Yeah, let's go. Thank you. We are now produce, proceed to the entrance gates to your left. Please remember that if you are to leave the gates, a new set of tickets will be required for entry. Okay, that's fine. Show your tickets. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Alright, let's go into Fun City. Now, can we go into private action mode in Fun City? Yes, we can. Yes, we can. What do we got here? Oh. Wait, is that Reyna? What's she doing in here? Yeah, what is she doing here? Is that a fortune teller? Upon examining your compatibility level with Claude, I see that you two both lie under fortuitous stars. This bodes very well indeed. <laughs> really? That you have oh. nothing to fear. I am sure things will work out for you. If I had any advice for you, it would be to take a more active approach with him, if anything. Thank you very much. Claude, when did you get here? Oh dear. Oh, uh, I... Uh, I just came in. I saw the whole thing. Um, I saw the whole thing. What do you guys think? Yeah, let's go. Well, I've been here for quite a while, actually. Oh, you heard all that? Oh, no. Uh, I'm really glad you think of me like that. Uh, it's not like I care or anything. You shouldn't believe all that hocus pocus. Yeah, let's go with this. I'm really happy you think of me that way, Reyna. Ah! I guess I should have noticed that you had feelings for me sooner. <laughs> hmm? <laughs> what? Reyna? What a corny thing to say, Claude. <laughs> like, what? We're trying to be sincere here. Thanks, Claude. <laughs> I needed a laugh. Say what? I, uh, uh, wait. See you later. But I wasn't joking. Yeah, what the hell? Well, we actually got friendship points for that. Let's have a word with her. You're a friend of that young lady? How do you think we should interpret her last response? Was she only pretending? Or did she really believe that you were joking? No, I think, uh, I think she tried to save face. Yeah, I think I think she was just trying to save face. Okay. 
Well, what else? Other private actions? Or... Well, it looks like we've got some events and stuff. Uh, let's see what's in this giant bunny. Oh, bunny race reception. Oh, I might save this for later on. So that's a bunny race. That there's a... Oh, a tournament. That has to be a tournament, right? That's going to be interesting. Uh, hey, you want to try entering the arena contest together sometime? Not with you, Chisato. Not with you. I mean, you're probably good, but not good enough to enter with. Anyhow, guys, I think it's time for us to take a quick break here. When we get back, we'll probably be looking a bit more around Fun City, because, you know, it's fun and all that. You know how it is. And uh, if not that there, then getting back onto the main story and heading over to these four trials. Because, uh, you know, it's not a decent old school RPG unless you've got four trials that you've got to knock out. So, that is all for now. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.